Hi there, friends. Welcome back to Let's Play Illusion of Gaia. Oh my goodness, we have come a long way in this journey, and we are getting close to wrapping things up. Right now, we just finished the pyramid. We're gonna go talk to Neil about flying to the Tower of Babel. The Tower of Babel. Once you make up your mind, nothing's gonna stop us. I have made up my mind, and we're gonna go to the Tower of Babel. He's taking Kara and Eric back to South Cape, and this time the airplane won't crash. Well, I should hope so. Well, I should really hope so. Neil, thanks for bringing up that sore subject. Crashing an airplane. Be, you're lucky we're, we're, hey, Anchor Watt, we get to fly over Anchor Watt. Yeah, you're lucky we're, 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 we're trusting you to this. Oh my God, guys, look, we're here, we're here, the Tower of Babel. On oh, its own little island. You know, I gotta appreciate Kara and Eric. We we lost a lot of friends along the way for one reason or another, and they stuck it out the whole way. Say hello to your father. He's in the flute. You can talk to the flute. Uh, I guess I won't see you for a long time, says Eric. Oh, shout out to Eric. Thanks. We had to save him. We definitely had to save him a couple of times. Everyone found something, says Eric. Oh, he's reflecting. Oh, he's having a reflecting moment time. Lance met Lily and found his lost father. Neil decided to take over his parents' company. My cat just knocked something over. Made a weird sound a second ago, that's okay. Kara started to really live and saw a world outside the castle. I like how he didn't... I'm going to excuse myself. <laughs> what did you find, Eric? He's, you had a fun adventure. It doesn't, it doesn't mention that Lily found Lance, just that Lance found Lily. You know, Lily found Lance too. Was that not important? Yeah, look, you can go to the bathroom by yourself at night, Eric. Don't sell yourself short. All those trials, they build character. Kara hasn't said anything for a while. He was going to say also bye. Oh, that's not sketchy at all, Kara. Hmm, right. <laughs> well, we've reached the tower. Is your parachute ready? Let's go. <laughs> I don't, well, you can't land anywhere. He just kicks you out. Yeah, just, hey, there's the tower. Go. <laughs> In a year and a half. Well... Definitely saw more than one parachuter. Uh, but here we are. Can can't even leave. Nothing nothing to do but but to move forward. Wow. Look at this. Frieden statue. Oh, what did he just say? Oh, you know what it is? He found his flute here. And there's a red jewel. You know what that means? Haha, <laughs> that's all 50 red jewels! You have the 50th red jewel if you've been paying close attention. Um, more than that on a second. Cross the spiky pit. Um, oh, what's this? Something seemed to fall from the flute. Is it, is it you, Dad? It's King Edward's crystal ring. So remember back when you when you were tasked to bringing this crystal ring to the king and you had told him you didn't have it? Looks like you had it the whole time. You had it the whole time in that flute. I guess that's why the flute was so darn powerful, huh? Oh yeah, now you have to actually equip that to go through this uh, barrier there, this laser barrier. Nothing's getting through that laser barrier. Oh, pink, pink words. Except for Kara. Kara's walking through the laser barrier somehow, huh? Feel like if we part now, we'll never meet again. Why have you come here? Yeah. Yeah, I just bounced off of it until I equipped it. How did you do it? This crystal ring is dark blue. The ring you have is light blue. Oh, yeah. 
yeah, also remembering back. We're signaling back to a lot of the things that happened on the adventure. Um, but yeah, she pulled that ring off the mummified queen. Which sure did cause a ruckus. And, uh... Yeah, no matter what, don't leave me. Yeah, stick stick by me, Kara. She can also pass through those barriers. So... Everything we've gone through, this whole adventure, every party member that we had, it's come down to the just Kara and Will. All living things experience dramatic evolution as the comet nears the Earth's orbit. Well, it's getting close to the Earth's orbit, so we're going to have to hurry on. The evolution of living things took a long time. Human beings have evolved. Comets have been called the spirits of stars, but also the demons of stars. The one nearing the Earth is a demon. So it's a comet demon. The highest form of consciousness. A demon with the highest form of consciousness that's going to evolve the Earth beyond imagination. That's all we're up against. Cool. Passage of time is different inside the tower, but... Oh, they're not normal human beings because we can live here. Oh, what happened to my dad then? Must put them to sleep before we go up. Okay. Oh, well, good thing they gave us a save point. Our first trial in the tower. This is the Tower of Babel. And it's pretty obvious that we're kind of like towards the end of the game here. We're kind of in the conclusion here. Um, I don't think we can go forward. I don't think it'll let us, right? Yeah. Even with the ring, we can't pass through here until we clear that room out. What's in this room, you ask? I will show you. Look at this. What a throwback this is. Yes, this is the first boss that we fought. First boss we fought in the Larai Cliffs. Right before we jumped onto the gold ship. Our tactics won't change. There is a dark space right outside. I'm going to take every all of these hits. No. Look at me. I'm like, ah, eh, whatever. I'll take all the hits. All right. What, what, what should have happened <laughs> was that I just kind of um, took him out when I, on, uh, upon first swipe. Should have just taken him out this way. That's what should have happened. I shouldn't have let him, him kill me. Oh my god, I just died on the first boss in front of all of y'all. When I had full life, and then I beat him when I had half life. Okay. Sometimes we get a little sloppy, and that's alright. Yeah, we can get we can get topped off over here. I mean, why else have we saved a bucket full of herbs, huh? If not for this. Nothing like a good let's go back and fight the old bosses again challenge. We love those at the end of games. Reminds me of Mega Man. Another room. Alright, back to this guy, the Viper. Sky Viper, or whatever he's called. I don't know. This was the boss that we fought at the end of the Sky Garden. Both both of these bosses, the first time we fought as um, Frieden. But uh, as Shadow, I mean, Shadow is 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 just going to make quick, quick work. Oh, that one was a lot easier than the first one. I, I kind of want to go back and top off my life. Ugh. Yeah, that guy barely touched me. Let's just keep going. Let's not worry about it. Pass all these Frieden statues. We love you, Frieden. Come down here. Um, what are those pillars of lights? Oh, it's in teleport elevator. Neat. All right, and we continue. Is there anything over here yet? Anything over here for me? All right, next challenge, next boss. We are facing. 
Well, remember the first boss was the uh, guy at the cliffs, and the second boss was the viper from the sky garden. So now we're back to the land of Moo Boss. It's these guys, these these vampires. Oh no, 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 no! Don't hit me with that. Oh, that hurts so bad. Okay, can we do it? Can we do it? Oh, oh, oh. oh we got ballsy and we did it. We did it. Alrighty, we beat them without without urban up or anything. Yeah, I am taking a bit of a reckless just charge at them and, and don't even try to dodge. And I'm not necessarily advocating for that approach. It's 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 hurting me a lot. Will is in a lot of pain. Oh no, and I don't get to heal. Oh look, you don't have a way to heal. You don't have a way to heal. You just gotta go in and fight this guy. So we're gonna take an herb. We're gonna go ahead and, and do that. Take an herb. Have two, in fact. They don't go bad, right? They don't go, they don't ever go bad. All right. We've already taken out three of the five bosses that we've had to fight up to this point. So um, now on to this boss, the boss of the Great Wall of China level, which was the uh, snaky, the sand fanger. Oops, one with the poison. Now this boss we had to fight um, originally as Will. We couldn't fight this boss as Frieden, so we had a very, very short range. Now with with Shadow, we it, it's a lot easier to uh, hit this boss as it does its uh, up and down move here. So I'm getting in a hit every time. Um, let's see where is it going to go? Oh. Kind of, you, you, you want to try to get him right as he's coming out of the hole. Oh, there we go. This will. That was a, that was a very productive. There we go. Very productive. And look, I didn't take a hit. I didn't even need any of those herbs, as it turns out. That's why we saved him. If you saved him for anything, you saved him for now. Where did Kara go off to? Said that text bit bubble. She is gone. We didn't, I didn't really uh, have a plan. Hey, hey second boss, how are you doing? You were brought back to save the earth. I'll take you to the top floor. Well, that's kind of you. I guess after beating this boss twice, it's on our side now. Go back this way, go in the door. Kara, where are you? Why did you go, Kara? All right, well, we're popping into this room. For the uh, last trial, where we're revisiting a former fight. And uh, yep, hasn't been too long since this one, right? Nothing changes here. We use the same tactic as we did at the end of the last Let's Play video. We don't. The only thing that sucks, and it's fine, but it's we we all those other fights we were doing a lot more damage than we had like upon the first the first time um, have have fighting them. The vampires, the sandfanger. Getting to fight them in shadow instead of freedom or will and with our maxed out stats meant that we got to enjoy a super overpowered version of uh, of offense. And this is just literally the exact same fight that we just did. But, that being said... That being said, we, um... We're pretty, uh, we're pretty strong as it is. I think we can handle this. There we go. As we remember, we're just waiting for the, uh... Solid... 
solid spirit to uh um, you're just I'm just trying to hit you little toesies there. Let me hit those toes. Uh oh no. Oh man. Damn. Oh no. Ugh. Got a fighter again. I was right about to go take an herb too. I was I was like I was gonna just do it. Oh gosh. So impatient. I don't even know what I'm what am I even hoarding those herbs for? Alright. Alright, let's just let's just jump to the end of this fight. Okay, and we're back here. We're back where we should have been. <laughs> One swipe away from beating that mummy queen. I got I don't know what was going on with me. I was just not patient at all <laughs> against her. I I just took several losses um, off camera there. Um, and I just swallowed my pride, had a couple herbs, and just finished it off. So that's, that's that. That's where we are. Oh. I remember this is so, this is so weird. The, com <laughs> the vampire's coming to also be our friend. We've made friends with all the bosses. Yeah, I don't know what was going on with me, but uh, I just, I just was having the, I just, I just wasn't focusing. I don't know. I'm sitting here just chatting, chatting with all you, all, all my friends out there, and 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 not focusing on that mummy queen fight. Oh, Kara, there you are. Where did you, where did you, where did I go? You, you, you bounced. The vampire woman had come. They say that her body is eternal. That once the comet is gone, she'll be able to rest in peace. Oh, that's why they're all trying to help me out. Oh, shadow, shadow statues. Um, there we go. There's this dark space. Could have used you, uh, earlier there. Gosh. Please fill me up with life. This is the last time I'll talk to you like this in this place. Oh my goodness. Shadow's greatest fire power, the Firebird, will arise when you're one with the Light Knight. We need to restore Earth to its original condition. What a task to be tasked with um now talk to this guy before we go in if you proceed you will not be able to turn back we're at the point of no return so we're gonna return to Dow village and why is that because we gotta go see mr jeweler gem over here hey jeweler gem 50 red jewels you've got them all 50 suddenly you've gathered 50 red jewels it's time for secrets! Following him. I'm standing in the entrance to a strange mansion. Oh, look at that. 38 enemies and a treasure. These guys are uh, the same as like in the diamond mine. Those little guys. Diamond mine creatures. But we're Will. We're not Shadow. We're Freedom. So this is actually like a like a bonus dungeon. You can't come here without the fifty red jewels. I don't. I don't. I don't know if you're appreciating this right now. But all that work we've done, all that red jewel hunting, every last one of them just led to this moment here. This spooky final dungeon. I definitely didn't get here my first many playthroughs of this game. I didn't understand how to I didn't understand how to how to just necessarily gather all of them. I, I missed some. I didn't have YouTube to watch back then and I didn't really know how to get them all. There's a companion book that comes with this game. It does show you sort of where the red jewels are, but some of them were were elusive to me. Um, yeah, but we're just gonna, it just looks like the majority of these enemies, there's still 20 of them left, but, uh, we oh yeah, that, those guys, those guys are from the, uh, the first dungeon, the sewer. Um, so this is also a spot where any, any herbs you've saved up along the way can, can definitely be used here too.
These guys take quite a few hits to take out. Um, and I, I went through quite a bit of these dark jewels in the mummy fight just now, so I wouldn't hate it if I got a few more. What do we got here? Anything? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I love the uh, aesthetic of this dungeon, of this one here. Yeah, that's right, that's right, I knew there was one more guy around here. I'll just go up there and block that one out so it won't hurt ya. Okay, that one I don't think I can get to till later, right? I can't cross over there. I can't get to that. Yeah, they're all on the other side. Okay, we can't... Can't get to them yet, that's fine. Keep going. We're down to 13 enemies. Show them what you got, Will. Show them what you got, buddy. Um, I think we go under here, right? Is it... You have to slide? Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. You have to slide. You gotta use all every tool available to you. Nine enemies left. These guys are strong, too. If they don't want to take unnecessary hits or damage. Why did you leave us here? He's like, I got secrets for you, but... All it is is a dun... Okay. Okay. Oh, boy. Them two. There we go. Yeah, take a few swipes and then just stop. Just take that little extra... Take that little extra time to not get hit. I promise I'm good at this game. I'm not getting sloppy or lazy. That's not why it took me, like, all those tries to beat the Mummy Queen. <laughs> Alright, oh, don't go down there just yet. We missed a treasure. What if it's a red jewel, uh huh? The 51st red jewel. It isn't, but what if it was? Alright, so... Oh, wait, slide... No, slide... Come on. There we go. That's hard to do. Hard to backtrack. Okay, looks like I got ahead of myself there. Missed out on that treasure. Another herb. It's good because we sure have been uh, hitting those up lately. The end game, really, you can just sink all your herbs into the end game. This whole bonus dungeon is um, complete now, sort of. We've beaten all the monsters, all the creatures. I kind of want to just preventatively just take an herb. There's one before we hop in here. Look at this. Welcome to my home. The jeweler gem is a temporary form. Uh, we've been lied to this whole time. It's solid arm that we've been coming after. This is a, a reference to Soul Blazer. The blazer came down from the sky and I was put to sleep for a long, long time. This boss solid arm in front of us, in fact, this room, these, these three treadmills, this is exactly what you have to deal with in the first Soul Blazer game, the prequel, the spiritual prequel to Illusion of Gaia. This is actually the first boss of Soul Blazer. It's in front of us here. And the power is contained in Red Jewels. Tried many things to bring about my own resurrection. It is I who manipulated the labor trade. I tried using forced labor to find them. Wow. I'm sorry, but I will have to defeat you too. Wow. So, the way you beat Solid Arm is you don't stand in front of them ever because of those things. You gotta like do a lot of blocking. You gotta do a lot of blocking here for solid arm. 
That's how the pattern goes. Gotta get them get solid on close enough to want to like attack you. <sighs> oh, there we go, taking some damage. Oh boy. All right. Well, we're going to curve up a little bit here. I'm going to show you how this pattern works. So, so you don't want to get too. See, see, if you stay in front of them, those things are gonna get you. You want, you want to draw him over to the side. <laughs> so, so, so bad. <laughs> um, okay, don't worry. I'm not gonna. I'm not. We're not. This this fight takes a second. Now you gotta. Dr okay, so again, I'm sorry. Draw him over to the side. Hit him a couple times. Block those. Sit here, you're gonna be just having to block. He's going to just constantly break, you know. You gotta trigger him to walk up back over to the other side of the screen. That arm, that arm swipe is always gonna take you out, so. If you, if you can make him go back and forth. Then you can. Kind of have a back. Kind of, kind of get into a pattern like that. This guy's really hard. <laughs> there we go. That's right. That's right. There we go. Back and forth. Back and forth. You gotta block, you block. Back and forth. There it is, there it is. Okay, we're almost... And, and you, you're gonna only do one damage. You just gotta be okay with that. This is what the herbs are for. guys we're back we've been wearing him down we got the pattern down you gotta hit the bottom wall here that's the only way to dodge the fireballs and then you gotta learn to about the center run over to here and get him run up that and swipe him once or twice that pattern took a while to work out I lost some lives I used my herbs but I didn't want to make you sit there and watch me grind that fight it's a tough tough fight in this game the hardest one in this game a lot harder than it is in soul Plazer. I was defeated again, says Solid Arm. Blazer was strong, but you, you are stronger. Will is stronger than Soul Blazer. Mm. Kind words from uh, Solid Arm. Danger approaches this planet. You should hurry to the Tower of Babel. Well, that's what we're told. That's what we're told. It's dangerous, so. Well, now that all the herbs are gone. Hopefully we're strong enough to beat this last fight without one single herb. Nah, I know that we are. That's gonna be it though for this episode. We're gonna watch the finale next time. We uh, got through the Tower of Babel and we got through the bonus dungeon and the bonus boss fight. And that's going to be where we're going to have to cut things off for now. But I imagine we're going to wrap this thing up next episode. Please like and subscribe. Um, comment on the video if you liked it. Tell me your favorite part. I love to see timestamps. And, uh, and, and, and tune in. Look forward. Catch the next episode. We're wrapping the whole thing up. And the grand finale um, is next. All right? Have a great day gaming, folks.